Hey everybody, welcome back to Jamia's promo and today is September 3rd and there is a pretty large update that just got pushed out today for the Galaxy Note 20 series. Now this one still is not the September patch, so I assume the September patch will probably come out in the next 7 to 14 days, but this one is giving you that security patch of August 1st. It's also the version of DUH1 and the size is 1,200 megabytes. Now that just means it's a little over 1.5 2 gigs which again is fairly large for an update usually updates of the security patches are right around 200 to 300 megabytes so that just means that there's a lot of newer versions of different applications and services that will be pushed along with this update so if you don't know exactly where to look for this update just make sure you go inside of your settings scroll down until you see a software update tap that go to download and install now anytime that you do an update you can always go back to your last update update. So the last update that happened for the Galaxy Note 20 series was on August 5th. This one did bring that August 1st patch. Again, it was pretty small update like it always is, right around 265 megabytes. So again, between 200 and 300 megabytes. Now this one is the second update that was pushed out for the month of August. Uh, but again, I think September will be coming up here in just a second. And so this is where you go to install now. So it's usually at this point in the video that if you guys are brand new here at the channel, Jimmy is promo, you appreciate these tips, tricks, and tutorials and the latest information information on all of these software updates for your Samsung phone. Make sure you guys hit on that subscribe button as well as the bell for notifications so you get notified for all future videos. So because this one is a very, very large update, it's about six times as large as it normally is, we will be going through multiple applications and services just to see what exactly has been updated because Samsung never tells us. So we'll be taking a look at the camera, home, messages, fingerprint reader, face recognition, the gallery, and Samsung internet. Then we'll take a look also at the Galaxy Store because there's always a lot of updates there. And I know quite a few updates has been pushed out on September 2nd, which was yesterday. Uh, so we'll be covering those in today's video as well. So the update is done and complete. So now we're just gonna take a look at a few applications and services just to see what has been updated again since Samsung never really says, you know, what has been changed. So originally the camera was 11.00297. It is now 11.00321, so there is a newer version of the camera. Then let's go inside of Samsung Home. And really what you want to do is go anywhere on the home screen, press and hold. Then you just want to hit on the settings on the bottom. Now originally it was 12.1077. This one was 12.1073. So there's a newer version of Samsung Home. Now let's go inside of Messages. Now before the update, Messages was 12.15011. And now it's 12 2 10 19. So you do have a newer version of Samsung Messages. Now we're going to go inside of the fingerprint reader and face recognition. Once inside of settings, just go down to biometrics and security. Then you want to click on more biometric settings and then biometric security patch. So originally the fingerprint was 5101. It is now 5102. And then face was 20113. 20228. So it looks like the Galaxy Note 20 basically is getting almost every single Samsung application and service and biometrics updated with this brand new update. Again, the reason why it is so large. Now we're going to take a look at the gallery just to see if we have a newer version of the gallery. So it was originally 121088 or I'm sorry, 121080. And so it's the same thing here, 121080. Eight, zero. So no new version of the gallery. Now let's take a look at Samsung internet. Originally the internet before this, this update was 150247. 150247. So it looks like the very last two that we took a look at is not new. Uh, so no new version of gallery or internet. Now the last thing to take a look at is uh, gonna be the Galaxy Store. It's one of those smart things to take a look at because sometimes, you know, Samsung updates their Samsung applications through here rather than some of these security patch updates. So it looks like Microsoft Office, Zoom, Samsung text to speech, your phone companion, the Galaxy wearable app and Samsung Pay. So Samsung Pay, if you scroll down, you can see that this one was updated on September 3rd. 
yeah, so that is today. So that's a brand new update there for the Galaxy wearable application. As you scroll down, September 2nd, so that one was just yesterday. If there is an update, in terms of what they've done specifically, it'll be inside of this update info information. If you want to read about it, you can take a look at it. Uh, right over here, your phone companion. This was updated September 2nd. So we're not going to go through all of these ones here. Most of these on the very top here were Samsung stuff. I guess we could take a look at the text-to-speech really quick just to see when this one was pushed out. This one was last month, August 27th. Uh, so again, take a look inside of here, see if there's anything that you've missed, anything that's brand new. It looks like a few things pushed out within the last couple days, either yesterday or today. But that was pretty much it for today's video. There is a pretty large update for the Note 20 series. If you guys have the Note 20 with really any carrier, you guys can write a comment below the video if you guys have received this update. Now, this is not the first update for August. As you've, as you've seen, the last update that was pushed out for the Note 20, at least that I've seen, was August 5th. And then now we have this one here for uh, basically September 3rd, but still again for the month of August. And I think that September update will be pushed out maybe in the next 7 to 14 days, hopefully maybe 10, just so then this way we can get something new uh, that's going on here. But other than that, I hope you guys appreciated this video. If you guys did, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Subscribe right over here in the very bottom left-hand side. And if you like this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later.